Plenty of time and a wide open receiver inside the red zone. It's Jared Pinckney down to the five yard line. Big time hookup from Shermer. They got a couple of tight ends set up that way along with CJ Duncan. Now Shermer off the back foot to the end zone. Touchdown Vanderbilt. On second and one, Vandy blitzed off the corner and it got picked up. And now Ertz has room across the 30, inside the 25 where he's brought down. Ertz is the ball carrier to the corner and into the end zone, standing up. Because I didn't put him in the game. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> now it's around the edge and some room to run, cutting it back inside the 40-yard line bringing a little bit of juice to the running game for K-State. And it is no good. Quarterback run. Ertz quickly flushed out of the pocket. He's not going to have the room to run, so he throws to the sideline. And the ball is tipped and taken away by Vanderbilt. Going down the sideline, Ladarius Wiley. And they've really liked it. Bumble. Webb goes down, the ball pops out, and K-State falls on it, but this is going to get reviewed. No question about it. Interesting front here from Vanderbilt. It turns into a four-man rush. Pocket collapsing, and the ball is picked off again. Ryan White with the second pick of the night for the Commodores, and they're set up in prime territory again. Shermer loading up. He goes inside the five-yard line, down toward the goal line, and stopped at the one. Shermer picks it up on third down, fakes the throw, goes to the end zone, stretches, and he got it! Touchdown, Vanderbilt! Ertz drops, surveying the field. He's got all sorts of time. Now pressure, steps up looking to run. Across the 20, he cuts back, and it's gonna be close, but the initial spot shows a turnover on downs. Can Vanderbilt be the team to beat in the SEC East? This is a good way to get that conversation started on a steamy Saturday. The Commodores go to 3-0 for the first time since 2011.